In today's video, we are going to talk about the herbs that are safe for your cat. Everybody knows that there are several benefits for those who eat certain herbs. They taste great and are often loaded with lots of vitamins. Herbs can help reduce the risk of cancer, treat a cold and a cough, help maintain flawless skin, help fight against infections, maintain healthy bones, the list goes on. Herbs are not just good for humans. Cat owners might be surprised that certain herbs are also great for their little feline friends. Not only will your cat enjoy these delicious herbs, but they also have lots of health benefits. Catnip Perhaps the most obvious addition to this list is catnip, a long-standing, natural favorite of cats and owners everywhere, and probably the first thing you think of when it comes to feline-friendly herbs. This unique herb not only helps many cats relax but actually has some distinct benefits when used correctly, such as relieving stress in cats, curing itchy skin, calming nervous cats, because they're a part of the mint family, you can expect catnip plants to grow quickly and spread across your garden, so it may be a good idea to keep them contained in a single pot. If you don't want to simply give your cat a dried plant, making our own organic cat treats with your homegrown herbs can be a fun, simple activity. Cat time. Your cat should experience similar soothing effects from cat time as they would from catnip. The main issue with cat time is that it can give off a disgusting odor which most people find difficult to stand. If you can handle the bad odor the herb gives off, and you have the patience to grow it as it does take a lot longer than most other herbs, it will prove very beneficial for your kitty. If your cat has issues with catnip, there is a strong possibility they won't react well to cat time either. Valerian Humans and cats react to valerian very differently. When we take valerian it helps us to relax and sleep better. However, when we feed this to our pet cats, it works as a stimulant. If your cat tends to lay around the house doing nothing most of the time, this herb will help get them to get moving. Most cats adore the taste of the herb. Golden Seal Perhaps one of the lesser-known cat-friendly herbs, Golden Seal has natural anti-inflammatory properties that can help your cat out every now and again. This herb is a natural disinfectant and helps to remove bacteria and other debris from any wounds your cat might obtain while out exploring while simultaneously reducing any redness and swelling that might be occurring as a result. Each and every one of these herbs have plenty of undeniable benefits when used correctly with your kitty. Whether you're looking to promote healthy activity levels, encourage your cat to settle down to sleep at night or simply prepare for any wounds or other emergencies that might arise, turning your gardening attention towards these key herbs can make a huge difference with your cat's health while simultaneously bonding with your feline friend. While these remedies are certainly natural and should be healthy, there are a few guidelines you'll want to follow to ensure you're really doing what's best for your cat. First, before you plant your first seed, take the time to reach out to your vet to ensure you're getting the right products and that your cat doesn't have any pre-existing conditions that could cause the herbs you're growing to be ineffective or even dangerous. Your veterinarian can identify any problems and recommend some different cat health products if there are any potential issues. Next, when you do settle down to start your garden, remember not to use any potentially toxic pesticides on the plants you're planning to offer your cat. Even in small doses, weed killers and other chemicals can cause serious health issues and may even be fatal in larger amounts. Researching a few natural pest control methods for your garden is a must if natural remedies are your go-to method for taking care of your cat. Regardless of whether you just grow a few sprigs of common catnip for your cat to enjoy during the warmer months or you're considering making a full medicine cabinet for caring for your kitty in the coming years, these herbs can provide you with an excellent way to care for your kitty in a natural, affordable and sustainable manner for years to come. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. Licorice Root When you were a child you probably remember licorice candy. Whatever you do, don't feed this to your cat as the candy consists of lots of harmful ingredients such as sugar, salt, malic acid, and artificial flavoring. However, most kitties love to eat this herb and it has lots of health benefits especially if your cat is suffering from arthritis. Here are some of the benefits you should expect if you feed your cat licorice roots. Helps soothe cats suffering from itchy skin. Helps with their digestive system. Helps cats fight against colds. The root also has anti-inflammatory properties. Dandelion root. Not only will a dandelion look pretty in your garden or on your balcony, but it helps liver detoxification. It also helps maintain your cat's urinary tract. If your cat is suffering from constipation it is a great natural remedy that many cat owners use. Don't throw away the dandelion leaves either as your cat can also eat them too. Eyebright. 
Don't be worried if you have never heard of eyebright as this is probably the most uncommon herb mentioned on our list. This herbaceous plant can help with upper respiratory issues that some cats suffer from. Here is a list of some of the benefits when feeding your cat eyebright. Helps cats with breathing problems. Helps cats suffering from nasal problems. Stops cats from constantly sneezing. Helps cats to stop itching their eyes. Supports a cat's immune system. Most cat owners make eyebright into herbal tea for their cats to drink. Others use it to clean a cat's eyes or nose. Echinacea. This herb is often found growing in the summertime in North America. It is fairly common for our feline friends to suffer from upper respiratory infections at times, and echinacea can be used to treat these infections. Cats can become immune to this herb, so speak with your veterinarian to help you understand the proper dosage. The veterinarian will take your cat's weight and age into consideration before giving you advice on dosage. Calendula Calendula is a herb that many pet owners use to treat their cats who are suffering from itchy skin. If the correct amount of calendula is given to your cat here are a few of the benefits you should expect. Treats minor bruising. Offers relief if your cat has been bitten by an insect. Help keep wounds clean. Helps soothe itchy skin. Make sure that you contact your veterinarian before using calendula as it is known to have severe side effects. Parsley. Parsley is great for both humans and cats. Parsley helps fight against infection and also has antifungal properties similar to the dandelion root. You should feed your cat parsley because it has high levels of folic acid, antioxidants, calcium, potassium minerals, iron, vitamin A, vitamin K, vitamin B complex. Don't feed your cat too much parsley as it can lead to diarrhea and vomiting. You care about your feline friend. You want to offer them something special that they can really enjoy. Whether you simply don't have the cash for expensive cat toys or don't like using store-bought cat treats and foods, it can sometimes be difficult to find a way to treat your cat and really show them that you care. Not all herbs are good for cats. Garlic, chives, marijuana, St. John's wort, and others can all have a devastating effect on your cat if ingested. Always speak to a professional for advice before feeding your cat any of the herbs that were mentioned. Regardless of whether you just grow a few sprigs of common catnip for your cat to enjoy during the warmer months or you're considering making a full medicine cabinet for caring for your kitty in the coming years, these herbs can provide you with an excellent way to care for your kitty in a natural, affordable and sustainable manner for years to come. Improve your cat's health and mood with these homegrown herbs. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.